We turn our attention to Undu State, where the inability of the governor, Loki Aida Tiwa, to appoint a deputy three weeks after he was sworn in is uh, generating reactions from different quarters. A lawyer, Femi Omoda Mori, and a former presidential aspirant, Wilson Kubese, asked the governor to address the issue with all seriousness. Ayodeji Moradia has more on this. Undoubtedly, the passage of Governor Rotimi Akiridolu on the 27th of December 2023 left a vacuum in the political landscape of Undo State. His death changed the political structure and calculation with Governor Loki Ayidatiwa coming from Undo South Senatorial District. More than three weeks after Governor Ayidatiwa assumed duty, the post of the Deputy Governor is still vacant. The delay in nominating a new deputy governor for the state is generating reactions from different quarters. An Akura-based lawyer, Femi Emoda Mori, expressed the worry about this development, which he described as unconstitutional. The legal practitioner urged the governor to appoint his deputy without further delay. Absolutely no justification, in my own opinion, for there to be a vacuum in the office of the deputy governor for a period of over 24 days. One, that delay is unprecedented in the constitutional history of Nigeria. Two, it's also not constitutional. We've had more than enough time to consult and appoint a deputy governor. We are not saying this because we are praying for anything bad. But the office of a deputy governor is very, very important for a state. You can't be a governor when you don't have a deputy. So you also cannot be ruling as a governor without a deputy. A social commentator, Wilson Ikubese, said the task of selecting who deputizes of Naida Tiwa should be treated with urgency. The question is, are we missing the role of the deputy governor? The answer is no. Why no? Because uh, from our constitution, there is no assigned role to the office of the deputy governor. But for political expediency, yes, the, dep the governor cannot exist alone. But where should the governor pick his deputy from? Some think that because the governor came from the north and that uh, he came from the south, now that he's governor, the north ought to be compensated. So if the deputy governor is supposed to be zoned to the central, then are the central people sleeping? Now they will not allow that that belongs to their own central senatorial district. People of the state are watching closely where the deputy governor will come from and when he will be appointed. Ayodeji Moradeo, TVC News, Akure.